about e-government in Turkey. What is e-government? E-government is the access and delivery of government services to benefit citizens. It aims to help strengthen government's drive toward effective governance. By the way, government services are expected to be delivered to the students feast seamlessly with high quality in the easiest and the most effective way. E-government began to take place the bureaucratic and classic concept of state with the understanding that every individual can access the services provided by state agencies and institutions with information and communication technology services. You can see the portal www.turkiye.go.tr This is the portal for e-government. It's a citizen portal providing a single point of access to all public services through which users will be able to access the information and services easily. Through this portal, it is possible to access two kinds of services, accessing to the contents of elucidating integrated electronic services or electronic public services. Services uh, which are provided to students in general can be grouped as follows. Payment transaction like taxes, like fees, if you have traffic uh, punishment, you can use e-government to payment transactions. Shortcuts for institutions and organizations. Updated information and announcements. Messages to the citizens from the institutions. Sharing of information and documents between public institutions. The biggest benefit of this portal is with only the identification card or a password, a password or e-signature are delivered by hand and by using these authentications, citizens can access to provided electronic services. For example, if you want to use uh, e-government, you can go to post office directorate, you can apply in per you can uh, apply personal in person and uh, after paying only two or two two or one liras one lira or two liras you they give you a password and uh, when you get home you can change the, this password and you can use uh, e-government very easily E-government portal have design features which enable easily use for disabled citizens. Also, the government uh, never forgets the disabled people. It's not required to pay an extra fee to benefit from the provided services. At first, when you get the password, at first only you have to pay one lira or two liras. Very, uh, it is nothing. Very small amount of money. With this aspect, this portal has provided the infrastructure and also a model for other countries. Thank you.